is good, Boss Nation. Your boy back with another episode of Madden Ultimate Team. We are now on episode number 10. In the previous episode, you guys saw we made a lot of changes. And guess what? Today, you guys are going to see even more upgrades to my team. This is going to be probably the biggest upgrade that you will see up to date as far as my team goes. So last time you guys saw, I added AJ Green, Robert Griffin. Defense didn't really see many upgrades. It is still the same. Now I decided to take a glance at the marketplace and I'm not sure if this is the first time that Madden is doing it this year but it's my first time seeing game changer packs. So I quickly decided to open up a bundle. It comes with a guaranteed elite color rush player in the bundle topper. So obviously we're going to save that for last and let's go ahead and open up our game changer packs and see what kind of stuff we can get. As you guys see there's so many gold or better players you can get. But in my first pack here, I basically got all gold players. I'm not going to lie. This is a pretty crazy pack. Imagine if you could get like a bunch of elite players. We're going to keep on trying though. Even though we got all gold in the last pack, you never know. I'm hoping I could walk away with two or three. A couple of weeks ago, we got like five elites in one pack. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. We get Sean Smith, even though we already have him. As long as we're seeing red, that's all that matters. And out of these packs, you also get that gold badge, which is also going to be important later on when we try to complete some sets. Jumping into the next one, I'm not going to lie, I am going to be skipping a few that aren't too interesting. I'm going to just show you guys like the interesting ones. You guys see once again, just straight up gold for me. I can't imagine what some people got. Like for me, it was just... It just didn't seem like it was my day. We end things off with an all gold pack. And that was the story with the remainder of the packs. We're down to the final one. And then we got the bundle topper as well. So hopefully we could walk away here with one elite player. And there you have it. You guys see the red flash. It is an Earl Thomas. Another secondary for me. It just seems like I always say this in my videos. Most of the elite pulls that I've been getting have been like safeties or cornerbacks. You guys see Laguerre Blunt right there. That's not bad at all. We're down to the last two cards. We get a Coney Ely and a Bobby Wagner, which might as well be an elite player. All right. Well, the moment that you have all been waiting for, our elite color rush topper. Who can we get? We're about to find out in just a second. It's a Jarvis Landry. decided for this video and maybe in the next few episodes as well to move Jarvis Landry where Odell Beckham is. I didn't want to move AJ Green yet nor DeAndre Hopkins. So for now, I'm going to put Jarvis Landry in the slot. We'll put Odell as wide receiver number four. You guys see Josh Dobson and then Deshaun Jackson. They are still on my team. Let's go ahead and take a look at the defense. Now, I have been working on a set and it has to do with the middle linebacker spot. So... I hate to do this, but Luke Keekly is going to be cut from my team. I'm going to put him up on the auction block. Rashad Jones, he is also going to be exiting my team. We now have to bring in a new strong safety. And I'm only doing this so we can, like, you know, see new players on my team so it doesn't get boring. Khalil Mack, I'm not getting rid of him, but I did get rid of Clay Matthews. Khalil Mack will be left outside linebacker number two. So we have to bring in a left outside linebacker number one. Now, starting things off, I am going to be upgrading the middle linebacker spot. I have been working on this set right here. Mike Singletary. I have one more item remaining, and that is his collectible. His collectibles go for like 19 to 20K. When I was playing this, it was about 18 so I was like, you know what? With no hesitation, I decided to go ahead and drop those coins to complete the set. There you have it, 92 overall. Middle linebacker, Mike Singletary. Next up, our new strong safety. It might not be a crazy upgrade from Jones, but you know what? I have been wanting Cam Chancellor on my team for a while, so I decided to go ahead and bring him to my team now. And our new left outside linebacker will be the man himself, Von Miller. 
Well, all the empty positions, we just went out there and bought the players to fill it up. And here is our new middle linebacker, left outside linebacker, and strong safety. If you guys think it's over, well, it's not. I'm also going to be upgrading my defensive line, starting things off at the right end spot. Mario Williams is not getting cut, but I did make him the second string right end on my team. So now we have to go out there and bring in a starter. At the left end spot, I did decide to go ahead and cut Michael Bennett. So now at the left end spot and the right end spot, we need to go out there and get some starters. And I decided to quickly go ahead and hit up the auction block. Jaquee Smith, hopefully I'm saying his name right. I'm going to call him Jack Smith. Left end for the Tampa Bay Bucks. This is the award winner edition, 87 overall. Not too much of a crazy upgrade, but this guy right here, Charles Haley, is about to be a baller on our team. Ladies and gentlemen, those are the two upgrades at the right end and the left end spot. I have two more upgrades to make now even though this guy got a crazy interception in the last episode sean smith will be cut from my team and instead i'm gonna go ahead and bring in a new cornerback and that is the flashback janoris jenkins There's one more upgrade that I'll be making, and that is the defensive tackle position. Now, everyone got bumped down. Basically, Fletcher Cox went to the defense tackle number two spot. Williams went to DT3. And the DT1 will be Gerald McCoy, the color rush edition for 117,000 coins. Ladies and gentlemen, here's your new defensive tackle. There you guys have it. I'm kind of exhausted from all the upgrades that we just made, but I really like everyone that we brought into this team. Let's go ahead and debut everyone. If you guys are enjoying this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let's go ahead and see what's about to happen here. You guys see me rocking the color rush. Saints in up arms, hands the ball off to Chris Ivory. Nothing really happening there. Pick up of three yards on second and seven now. Teddy drop it back. What can we do here coming off that turnover on third and 13? Yeah, I kind of forced it there to Jeremy Shockey. So now my opponent takes over once again. This time, it was a complete opposite of what happened in his first possession. You see him finding a wide open Jared Cook. That was completely my fault. We have to do better than what we did last time out. Griffin dropping back, taking a shot deep. DeAndre, speed kills. Bring out the red carpet. DeAndre Hopkins, 73 yards. And the Saints are within an extra point of time. This thing up. That was a really good way of responding to my opponent. You see him taking over here with two minutes remaining on third and nine comes up short. Now he makes a questionable decision here, goes for it on fourth down and turns the ball over. And now I'm taking over at the 31 yard line. A play later on second and inches. We're going to take off with Robert Griffin. You see me playing it safe and sliding because I am looking for the end zone. And that is exactly what we do here with Ricky Williams. There's still a minute change remaining here in the first half but Charles Haley brings down Teddy Bridgewater and it is now going to be third and 20 Teddy gets rid of it here double coverage I don't know why he threw it there it could have been picked off but he did decide to keep it smart and punt the ball here it's a very low punt fielded by Patrick Peterson who's gonna return this one to the 26 yard line so now with a minute remaining and three timeouts we could score another touchdown here and that is exactly what we do with just one play Jarvis Landry you already know I'm gonna go with a fake kick catch him off guard I got a man open that's Michael Orr why did I go with a rat catch if I went with a possession catch that would have been two points but look at this man my opponent with 50 seconds remaining he also has three timeouts left but he just could not do anything my defensive line was bringing so much pressure his way with 15 seconds remaining here in the first half i'm looking to score seven once again griffin dropping back keeping this one on the ground and griffin 
with zero seconds remaining scores a touchdown guess what we're gonna go for it again this time michael orr with the possession catch what a half man it was too exciting we basically did it all to start off the second half he came out here with a bang check out the spin move d'angelo williams breaks two tackles and finds the end zone what a run once again, we're going to take over here. I'm going to take a shot to Jarvis Landry. Yo, look at his hands, bro. I'm so excited that we have him on our team. And look at his dangerous pass. Like, it was right where it needed to be. Like, if it was thrown a little further, that could have been picked off. But Robert Griffin has been flawless here today. He's going to keep this one on the ground. Look at the wide open field. And Griffin, once again, decides to play it smart and slide. We're going with a play action. Griffin again. This time he gets hit, but we are at the two-yard line, so I handed the ball off to Ricky Williams, and that has to be the finisher. My opponent is still sticking around, even though this game is basically over, and once again, he threw it straight into my hands. That is user pick number two with Mike Singletary. I am so excited with the new players that we picked up. To end things off, how fitting is this? Jarvis Landry gets yet another touchdown. It was a blowout game. 40 to 14 i am just like i said so excited with all of my pickups everyone had a good debut and i really hope you guys enjoyed this video we have a new offense now and a new defense and i really hope you guys enjoyed another episode of mad and ultimate team hopefully you guys are having a good day thank you so much for clicking on this video it's your boy i'm to the boss i am signing out